Okay, so here we have the next question on the menu today, and it is asking us, how do we evaluate tan 45? Or pretty much what this is saying is tan 45, whoops, not, not 54, 45 degrees is equal to, uh, let's just say x. And we're trying to solve for who x is. Now, let's imagine this situation right now. Now, when we're thinking about these angles, we're oftentimes thinking in terms of like a trigonometry. So let's actually draw a triangle with a 45 degree angle. A right angle triangle, because that, that's a... Uh, our trigonomic knowledge is only going to be valid with right angle triangles. Or our, like our silk toe uh, procedures. So it's got to have one angle here that's 90 degrees. Here we're going to have 45 degrees, and here, well, the law of triangles, every triangle has a total internal angle sum of 180, so this is going to be 180 minus 90, that's 90, minus 45, that's going to be also 45, this has to be another 45 degree angle. So, as you can see, we have a isosceles triangle here, and um, this definitely has to be an isosceles triangle. has to be I saw so please triangle because of repeated angle okay I actually think I have an isosceles triangle that is just like this back here exactly this guy this guy right here is um, Okay, so, oh, maybe it's kind of tough to see because it's transparent, but um, you see this triangle right here, it's got a 90 degree angle, maybe because my hair is like where it's uh, more visible, it's got a 90 degree angle here, and these two angles are the same, if that's 90, these two have to be 45, okay, so um, this is an example of this, this exact triangle. So given that these are isosceles, these angles mean that these side lengths have to be the same as well have to be the same because of isosceles. Okay, let's call these um, L, the distance L, because we're already using X somewhere else, so we're going to use a different letter L. Um, oh, let me shrink down my camera ASAP fast. Okay, cool. So, um, with this given knowledge, we know that tan of theta, with our Soka Toa, Toa is opposite uh, T tan O opposite A adjacent. So it's going to be opposite over adjacent. But we also know that opposite has to be equal to adjacent. And they ha that has to be the case, otherwise this is not going to be a right ang uh, an isosceles triangle. And uh, th it has to be an isosceles triangle because of that 45 degree angle. So given that we have the same number on top and the bottom, uh, we, don't even, we don't even need to know what it is. It could be, um, you know, this... My triangle right here is maybe like um, 10 centimeters, but if we um, scaled this up to a similar triangle where we had like a 10 meter, um, right angle isosceles triangle, this would be exactly the same. We would have the same opposite, the same adjacent, anything divided by itself is 1. So we know that um, tan 45 degrees has to be equal to 1. No other possibility. And this is kind of like one of these um, relationships that you should try to keep um, like front and center in your mind because um, You'll definitely see 45 degree angles a lot. It's a very common, uh, common thing. Um, this also translates to like x equals y if we're thinking more in like a plotting sense. But um, we don't really need to uh, worry about that right now. Um, but otherwise, yeah, this is this is the way to go. So um, followed a similar procedure with a right angle triangle and thinking to our um, Sokotoa. But um, here we use Pythagoras theorem 
but I, I thought about using um, isosceles triangles. Oftentimes in mathematics, there's going to be multiple different methods that you can address problems, but you will always come to the same solution. And um, the beauty of math is that no matter how you come to the right answer, if you're right, no one can ever tell you that you're wrong in math. That's, that's the beauty of it. That's kind of why I liked it, because, you know, I, if you do the math good, you'll, you'll always be good. Okay, so... So cool. Um, they actually, it's not mandatory to do this, but um, it's still valid. Okay, so I, I can't say the wrong. It's math, and um, yeah. So this above solution is good. It's good. Um, could the conclusion in a uh, faster? A shorter way to go. Cool. 